More than 80 animals, most of them miniature horses, all suffering from serious medical issues, blindness, malnutrition, even breathing and hoof problems. It's a massive operation that's underway tonight to save all these animals. Yes, nine veterinarians and even more staff members are in rescue mode tonight, treating the miniature horses, donkeys, and cows seized at a property in Baytown. They were taken from Baytown to the Houston SPCA this afternoon, which is where we find our Ryan Korsgaard reporting now. Ryan? Bill, and they keep on arriving. In fact, in the last 15 or 20 minutes or so, enough animals to fill up a trailer just like that. An anonymous tip led to the rescue of about 80 miniature horses, two donkeys, and a cow this morning from property in Baytown. The Houston SPCA cruelty investigators and horse specialists said that some had no fresh drinking water and suffer from a list of medical problems. Each individual animal has special needs. We'll know more once blood work is taken, but at this point, just visually, you can see that there were overgrown hooves, broken hips, total blindness, partial blindness, um, lameness. Um, we don't know to what degree um, the level of pain that the animals are in. Judy Kunsel with the Houston SPCA said it appears that the owner used the horses for show and that the operation simply got out of hand on a very large piece of property. A team of nine veterinarians is checking each and every one to see what other issues the horses could face. Our objective is to come in and protect those um, who don't have a voice. And in this case, it was the miniature horses and the ponies. And, um, maybe even some additional livestock. She says recovery depends on the horse and the conditions. She says they will now get the care they need before they could be moved to the Houston SPCA's larger property in Hempstead. And I know the big question now is what will come next? We know there is a hearing next week that will determine exactly who gets custody. We're live at the SPCA. Ryan Korsgaard, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Ryan. And our coverage of this developing story extends to our website. We have images from the rescue as well as a link to the Houston SPCA where you can donate to help with the rescue and the medical expenses for these animals.